Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim in this session we are going to talk about osteoarthritis from pathoma so what is osteoarthritis it is an arthritis but it is not an inflammatory condition uh, it is a degenerative condition it is uh, a degenerative condition in which we have progressive degeneration of the articular cartilage uh, and it is the most common type of arthritis so the first thing that it is a degenerative disease in which we have degeneration or disruption or destruction of the articular cartilage for example this is one bone for example this is a second bone and uh, in between them we have the articular cartilage up here so if we have destruction of this articular cartilage it is called osteoarthritis so it is a degenerative condition it is a destructive condition which results in the destruction of the articular cartilage the cartilage which is present in the joints is called articular cartilage and we have destruction of this cartilage in osteoarthritis so it is uh, often most often due to wear and tear uh, it is often due to destruction wear and tear means destruction uh, the a destruction with uh, which occurs with the use is called wear and tear so what are the risk factors age is a risk factor obesity is a risk factor and trauma is a risk factor so why does age cause osteoarthritis because with the passage of time there is increased destruction of the uh, articular cartilage uh, with like if a person is uh, 60 year, years old uh, he is more likely to have used articular cartilage more than a person that is 30 years old so with with use the articular cartilage is usually destroyed so age is a risk factor for osteoarthritis obesity is a risk factor for osteoarthritis because if a person is obese he is putting more pressure on this joint and he is causing this articular cartilage to be just destroyed so uh, do not be obese uh, trauma is a risk factor because trauma can destroy this articular cartilage by direct blows and it can result in uh, osteoarthritis it is oligoarticular it affects some particular joints for example it affects the lumbar spine it affects affects the hips the knees and uh, in the hands it affects the uh, proximal interphalangeal joints and the distal interphalangeal joints what is the presentation the uh, presentation is morning stiffness that worsens during the day so you should remember this word it worsens during the day this is very important because if there is a degenerative condition uh, if you use it more uh, there will be more pain because there is destruction of the cartilage and if you use it more there will be more rubbing of the bones against each other and there will be more pain so it is a simple concept that there is destruction of the cartilage now the bones are in direct contact and if you use it it will cause pain so the pain increases with use it worsens with use it worsens during the day uh, and the more it has morning stiffness which lasts up to 30 minutes uh, the pathological features include disruption of the cartilage or destruction of the cartilage the articular cartilage which is present in the joint space and the fragments of the cartilage floating in the joint space are called giant mice so we have the if this is the cartilage it is destroyed and the different the particles of this uh, cartilage then floats in the joint space and these are called giant mice uh, we have eburnation of the subchondral bone so the subchondral bone, bone is polished because of the constant rubbing against each other we have osteophyte formation osteophyte is a reactive bony out, outgrowth for example if the articular cartilage is destroyed the bones will come against each other if they come against each other they will form reactive bony outgrowths which are called osteophytes uh, they classically appear in the uh, proximal interphalangeal joints which are called uh, Bouchard nodes and the uh, distal in interphalangeal joints which are called Heberden nodes so uh, if you see these nodes and someone asks you what are these nodes these are actually osteophytes these, these are reactive bony outgrowths because of the rubbing of the bones against each other so now to sum it up what is osteoarthritis osteoarthritis is a degenerative joint disease it is the destruction of the articular cartilage it is a disease in which the articular cartilage is destroyed the cartilage which is present in the joint space is destroyed it occurs because of wear and tear it occurs because of age because with more age there is more use of the articular cartilage there is more destruction of the articular cartilage obesity if a person is obese there will be more pressure on his articular cartilage 
imagine there will be more destruction of his articular cartilage trauma is a risk factor because trauma can destroy the articular cartilage and result in osteoarthritis the joints which are affected are um, the lumbar spine the hips the knees the proximal interphalangeal joints and the distal interphalangeal joints we have uh, joint stiffness which uh, worsens with use because with use there is more rubbing of the bones against each other and more pain uh, there is disrupted destruction of the cartilage eburnation of the bone and osteophyte formation which result in bouchard and uh, hubbard and nodes so this was all about osteoarthritis thank you very much